the Golden State Warriors are looking to make a massive trade. As you all know, the Warriors are looking to make big moves this offseason. So in today's video, we're going to be going through five potential NBA superstars that the Golden State Warriors are looking to sign and trade and are looking to help them win another NBA championship. So make sure to like this video. And guys, 92% of you are still not subscribed to the channel. So it would mean the world if you could subscribe to the channel in that red button down below. The first is trading for Zion Williamson. Now, as you all know, Zion hasn't had himself the career that a lot of people expected but he is still a very fantastic player and he did a great job for the New Orleans Pelicans but he could now join a Golden State Warriors roster. When it comes to Zion last season he did have himself 22.9 points, 5.8 rebounds and 5 assists which was fantastic to see and he also shot a field goal percentage of 57%. Now when it comes to Zion Williamson he didn't have himself such a blockbuster season and because of that his trade value has definitely decreased quite a bit and because of that it definitely does give the Golden State Warriors a great opportunity to get a young star on their hands before he actually becomes that big guy. When it comes to Zion, he is still only 24 years old, so he's definitely not even entering into his peak years just yet. We tend to see a lot of NBA players do very well from around 25 all the way to around 33, and because of that, he is still continuing to develop, but now he can do it with a new Golden State Warriors roster. Zion is a great player, and I think what he does very, very well is definitely dominate the inside, even at six foot six 284 pounds when we look at that sort of stature we see a similar situation with draymond green draymond green may not be as strong as zion but he is six foot six and he does play a very good power forward position and we could see a next up and coming draymond green in zion williamson zion not only finishes at the ring very very well but his strong force around the paint and also on defense is definitely a force to be reckoned with which is why i think he would be a great addition to the golden state warriors roster the Golden State Warriors definitely need that little bit of extra firepower and although they have gotten some great great players you know to really help that with Kyle Anderson or also Buddy Hield, I do believe they need another star in this team if they want an actual shot at winning another NBA championship and when it comes to that it could be Zion Williamson now in order to get someone like Zion they wouldn't have to trade up too much they definitely would have to give up some key players maybe Andrew Wiggins maybe Draymond Green but on top of that we don't really know since the New Orleans Pelicans are in full rebuild mode and they are looking to get rid of all their stars. And because of that, we could actually see a team like Pelicans be interested more into actual draft picks than anything else. The second is none other than Giannis Antetokounmpo. Now this one is definitely more of a stretch, but it has been rumored all over ESPN and also a lot of analysts have been talking about it that the Golden State Warriors are looking to make a pursuit for Giannis Antetokounmpo coming into this offseason as you all know they did lose clay thompson and on top of that they are looking to ship off andrew wiggins as well and maybe even a couple of other players to really free up cap space and to actually make room if they are looking to go for another star when it comes to Giannis Antetokounmpo we all know what he's capable of doing on the floor six foot 11 242 pounds great great power forward also eight time all-star eight time all-nba and also has an nba championship under his belt now last season he did actually average 34 point points which is great to see and on top of that he also did grab 11.5 rebounds and dished out 6.5 assists while also doing this on a 62 percent field goal percentage so Giannis Antetokounmpo was is definitely playing very very well and due to the fact that when it comes to actually Giannis and the Bucks they haven't been able to perform very very well when it comes to you know in the playoff run they definitely have struggled and even training for Damian Lillard which they thought would definitely make a huge difference they seem to really struggle getting back into the NBA finals now although ESPN analysts have mentioned that this trade could definitely happen I do believe as an actual Warriors fan in order for them to actually pull off this trade the Golden State Warriors would have have to give up quite a lot it is Giannis he is still a very young player and he is just heading into his peak years and because of that they would have to give up players like Andrew Wiggins like Jonathan Kaminga maybe even Draymond Green and maybe even a couple of draft picks in order to actually pull this off I am just being realistic in that sense but is it still possible yes it is the third is none other than DeMar DeRozan now as you all know DeMar DeRozan has been playing great for Chicago Bulls but he does want his way out of it due to the fact that he does want to win a ring right now and i think golden state warriors could be a perfect fit for it when it comes to clay thompson as we all know he has left the team and we did replace him with players such as buddy Hield and also other players like kyle anderson however i don't believe it is enough fire 
power to get it done and DeMar DeRozan can definitely fit that bill. When it comes to DeMar, he is 6'6", 220 pounds, 34 years old, and he did average 24 points, 4.3 rebounds, and 5.3 assists in the last season. So he did a great job and I think he will be able to provide a lot for this Warriors team. He may not give you 30, 35 points. I definitely do believe that is going to be Steph Curry's job coming into this next season. But I do believe DeMar DeRozan can still provide that scoring that this team needs in order to really make it over that hump, make it back into the playoffs, and hopefully win another NBA championship. Now, when we look further, when we see DeMar DeRozan's numbers, we've actually seen him steadily improve as time goes on, not just in the points category, but also in the rebounds and assists. He did have his probably peak season in 2021-2022, but when it comes to the most recent season, I still do believe he is still putting up very efficient numbers, especially improving his three-point percentages as time goes on. So, yes, he may not give you, you know, that star power that Steph Curry gives you but I do believe he can create a great supporting cost for Steph in order for them to have a legitimate shot at actually winning an NBA championship the great thing about DeMar DeRozan as well is that he is a little bit of a two-way player as well he's got great defense which I think is super important and it is something that the Warriors desperately need especially with what is going on since they did lose Clay Thompson who was a 3 and D guy the fourth player is Brandon Ingram now as you all know we just recently talked about Zion Williamson but we also could actually have an opportunity at getting Brandon Ingram now either one I think would be great but when it comes to Brandon Ingram like I mentioned before the New Orleans Pelicans are looking to completely rebuild, reshift everything, and actually get a new star on their hands. I think Brandon Ingram could also be another great fit. The great thing about Brandon Ingram, he is heading into his peak years, 26 years old. He's six foot eight, 190 pounds. So he is a tall player, but he does remind a play style like of Kevin Durant. I think that is something that the Golden State Warriors definitely need. As we all know, we all know how great the run of Golden State Warriors was with Kevin Durant, and why not get young Kevin Durant in the making which is Brandon Ingram himself now last season he did a great job averaging 20.8 points 5.1 rebounds and 5.7 assists so he put up some really good numbers when it came to the New Orleans Pelicans but when it came to that season for the Pelicans they didn't end the season that they the way they wanted to and because of that the Pelicans are looking to actually ship him off and they could actually get him for a pretty good price when it comes to the Golden State Warriors the Warriors wouldn't have to give up too much since the Pelicans are desperate in need of actually trading him as they want to rebuild and they may be looking for maybe one star such as Andrew Wiggins and a couple of draft picks in order to actually pull that off. When it comes to Brandon Ingram we haven't seen him become an absolute star that a lot of people are destined to see him do. And he was 2019-2020 most improved player. He's a one-time all-star. So he does have a couple of accolades, but I do believe he needs that extra push to really become the next best player. And because of that, I think Golden State Warriors could definitely be a great fit for him. I think Ingram has all the right tangible skills in order to become a great offensive player. He may not be great defensively, but his 6'8", 190 pound stature definitely does help him out on the defensive side of things. So he is not a complete liability. But when we look at his three-point percentages as well he's shooting 36 percent from the three which he did last season also when it came to a two-point percentage he actually averaged 54 percent so he's a very consistent shooter and because of that that is something that the warriors desperately need especially during this time as they did lose clay thompson the fifth player is none other than laurie marketing now when it comes to laurie marketing he's still on the board due to the fact that golden state warriors haven't been able to work out a deal with him and there have also been other teams interested such as the Miami Heat. But I do believe the Golden State Warriors should definitely pull the trigger on this trade due to the fact that Laurie Marketing could definitely be a great fit for the Golden State Warriors. Now, as you all know, when it comes to the Golden State Warriors, not only are they a fantastic team, but I do believe they could use a shooting big man and a like superstar type big man in that essence. When it comes to Laurie Marketing, he had himself a great season, averaging 23.2 points, 8.2 rebounds, and two assists, while also shooting a three point percentage of 40 percent yes guys you heard that right 40 percent from the three for a big man that is seven foot there are only a couple of nba players specifically centers that can really put up those numbers especially at seven foot like i mentioned before seven foot 240 pounds he's definitely a big big guy and he would be a great fit and also add a lot of length that this golden state warriors team made as you all know the warriors have run small ball for so long now and it does seem to be catching up to them as it hasn't been working 
working as of lately. They've been trying to run small, fast-paced lineups, but it does seem that players that are coming into the league are not just taller, but also faster as well. You got your Victor Weminyamas, you got your Chet Holgrims, and because of that, it has definitely been a big, big issue for them. I think adding someone like Laurie Markkinen could not only just give them an extra offensive firepower, but it would actually add more defensive height to their lineup, which I think is going to be super important, not just in the shot blocking category, but also in rebounding and also just spacing out the floor as well, which I believe will have a good effect on the Golden State Warriors.